Welcome back everyone. Today we're going to be shedding light on what is failure. So what is failure? You may ask, is it the inability to elicit desirable outcomes without further ado, without further delay? Allow me to demystify that answer to that inquiry right here, right now. Succinctly stated, the abridged version is that failure is a occurrence of drawing force undesirable results. When you succumb to failure, you are not a lost cause. You have the latent potential to pull yourself out of the muck and mire. You have the latent potential to rebound. You should be imbued with energy. You should demonstrate some zeal, tenacity, fortitude, vigor, stamina. You're not a lost cause. Do not allow your efforts to be an exercise of sheer and utter unalloyed vanity. Do not allow your efforts to be nugatory, unavailing, nor fruitless. Pull yourself out of the muck and mire, re-strategize, and do not live a desultory life. Identify what are the requisite steps to allowing you to attain successful results. You want to be able to elicit desirable, fruitful outcomes. You do not want to allow your efforts to be in vain, to say the least. So, failure is an instance of attaining undesirable results. It is an instance of attaining an undesirable outcome. However, your life is not fatalistic. Your life is not immutable. You can be a pioneer of your own destiny. Take up the reins of your life. Do not live your life on autopilot. Do not acquiesce to being a lost cause. Amplify your knowledge base. Increase your core competencies. Build your repertoire. Be adaptive. Do not be maladaptive. Show some grit, determination, and conviction. Do everything in your purview to pull yourself out of the muck and mire and overcome your past failures. Do not allow them to define your future. Do not allow them to be an albatross. Do not allow them to perpetually set you back. You can thrive, prosper, and flourish. You can be a pioneer of your own destiny. You can triumph. You can surmount Braldignagian challenges. Do not be imprisoned in a state of fear. If a thought is insalubrious and inimical, expunge it from the bowels of your mind. Do not allow it to pervade the chasms of your mind. Do not allow it to take up precious real estate in your mind. Do not allow it to taint your neurons rent free. Expunge insalubrious sauce from the bowels of your mind. Ha harbor a higher positive to negative thought ratio. Cultivate an abundance mindset. And know that just by re-strategizing, by changing your approach to how to accomplish something, you'll be more apt, more poised, more primed to achieve desirable outcomes. You want to be able to draw force, fruitful, desirable, beneficent outcomes in life. So, do not wallow in despair. Do not harp on your failures. Just know that results in life are not guaranteed, and failure is an undesirable outcome. But as long as you re-strategize, revamp your approach to attain your overarching goals. You can overcome your past failures. Just because you are unsuccessful at achieving a certain goal in the past does not denote that you will be unsuccessful at achieving that goal in the pending future. Be a pioneer of your own destiny. So to recapitulate, failure is 
an occurrence of attaining undesirable results. It is an occurrence of attaining an undesirable outcome. You are not incapable of being successful. You have the latent potential to be profoundly successful if you so choose to do so. Strive to reach your higher aspirations or neural virtue and goals. I do not allow your past failures to be an impasse in your life. Do not allow them to perpetually set you back. You can overcome impending challenges that you are preordained to encounter in the future. You do not need to allow your future to be fraught with failures. Identify the measures, identify the requisite steps that you need to undergo to achieve desirable outcomes. So I hope that you found this video to be insightful and enthralling, as well as captivating, mesmerizing, riveting, and of course, engrossing. Even though failure is an instance of attaining undesirable results, you should not allow that occurrence to define your future, nor should you dwell on past failures. Thrust your life into a forward movement trajectory. Do not wallow in despair. Do not lose aspirants. You want to be able to manifest a prosperous, abundant, auspicious, and blissful future for yourself into reality. Failure is just a temporary setback. Do not allow it to be an insurmountable setback. Once again, I hope that you deem this video to be intriguing, informative, and insightful. Have a blissful day. Goodbye.